The other day we talked about the reason for not wanting to change. Because self-destructive behaviors make us feel like God at that moment. But what are the reasons for wanting a change? We divide them into three groups. Physical reasons for wanting a change. Something is wrong with my body and that is making me feel sick to some extent. And so I decide to stop a behavior so that I will feel better. I do feel better and this goes on for some time. But after some time I'm so well that I forget what it was like to be sick with that behavior and I start again. So any physical reason for stopping a self-destructive behavior leaves the back door open for relapse. The second reason why we would change is because our minds are getting so affected by what people are saying, what our own feelings are telling us about ourselves, that we must stop this behavior. And so for mental and social reasons, we decide to stop a behavior. Time goes on and pretty soon we find that everything that was condemning us, either mentally or socially, no longer exists. And so the reason for the change is gone. And so we are back to square one and we can go back to that self-destructive behavior. So if you look at it, physical, mental, social reasons all leave the back door open for relapse. So how do we get to a reason which stays? May I suggest a reason? And that reason is emotional and spiritual. And that reason says, why am I doing this self-destructive behavior? Because I am a shattered being. I'm not completely whole or healthy. And so just in order to feel whole, I do that behavior that momentarily makes me feel whole again. But I'm a slave to this behavior. So the moral choice, the spiritual choice, the emotional choice is, do I want to be a slave or do I want to be free? And let's not forget the great adage, freedom is my birthright. And once I make that decision that freedom is my birthright, then I have a solid reason for change. I want to change because spiritually, emotionally, I do not want to remain a slave and freedom is my birthright. So here it is. The Bible tells us if God will make you free, you will be free indeed. So here's wishing you a very happy free day today with breakthrough today coming your way with a great reason for change.